I just bought a home. Your girl just bought a home, first time homeowner. Um, I actually bought a townhouse. And so I think I wanna do a series of like home, pro home decor projects that I'm working on. Um, and so y'all, never mind my hair. I'm not, we're not about to get cute on camera to be like, putting stuff together, all right? We about to get our hands dirty around the house, so we gonna look how we look. But anyways, I think I'm gonna do a home decor series of like different areas of the house that I'm working on. Right now I'm working on um, like my kitchen living room area. Um, so I have some things from Amazon today. I have, what is this? I just have no idea what this is right here, but we gonna find out. Um, this is probably like a candle or something I ordered from Amazon. Um, I have some bar stools on the floor right here, which I'm not going to pick up because they're still in the box and the box is heavy. Um, but yeah, so we're just going to get our kitchen area together. Kitchen, lounge area, half bath. And then, yeah, like I said, we're just going to do a series as like I'm decorating my house. Like obviously when you get a house or you decorate, you really don't do it all at once. Like you kind of want to take like, take it section by section. So right now, this is the area that I'm mostly focused on. Um, I'm hosting Thanksgiving this year at my house. So I just want to make sure like the common area, the kitchen is together. That's my main focus right now. Um, I have a patio set coming next week. So I'll probably do another video of me putting that together and showing you guys what that looks like. Um, my bedroom, I'll probably do that last because like my bedroom's all the way at the top floor and like nobody's really going to be up there. So I'll probably do that last. Um, but yeah, anyways, we're rambling too much. So let's get started. So first things first, I need to clean up this kitchen because it's actually really dirty. I don't know if y'all can see, but these flowers need to go in the trash can. I got dishes in the sink. So we're going to clean first and then get to the decor afterwards. So I got this candle from Amazon. Can y'all see it? Without me like being on the camera. tray table thingamajig to put in the center of the counter like this and so not quite sure how we're feeling about that just yet um i think i am gonna have to fill that up some more maybe more candles my flower base, I definitely have to get more flowers because y'all saw that I just threw my other flowers out. Um, yeah, I don't know how to look up. All right, so this is what it's looking like up close. 
it's a mm, I don't think it's a lot bigger than what I expected it to be I just don't know how I feel about it of course I still have to fill it up so like I said I'm gonna have my vase with more flowers in here um but I, I didn't expect it to be this much room so I need more ideas on what should go in there Never mind my cutting board, y'all. That has to dry. And then these glasses go all the way at the top of this cabinet. But I can't get up there. So that's why they're just sitting right there. Um, but anyways, yeah. I don't know. We are... I don't know. We're going to have to get a feel for it. As far as... As far as the smell of this, it smells like... Mmm. So the notes are apple, orange, cinnamon, cloves. I definitely smell the cinnamon and the apple for sure. It's okay. It's decent. I feel like it's definitely cute for like the aesthetic that I'm going for. Um, maybe I should add, let's see if I should, I have this other candle up here. Sorry y'all, this cloth is messed. Um, I have this other candle right here from Target. I'm sure y'all have seen this before. Should I add that in there? That's too many candles. Um, that's too many candles to get now. Okay, we just gonna wait until we get some more flowers and see what it looks like once we get more flowers. All right, so let's go ahead and put together our um, bar stools and we're gonna see how that turns out. And then the last thing we're gonna do for today is attempt, keyword, attempt. <laughs> we're gonna attempt to install the new bathroom faucet I bought from Home Depot for my half bath and then that's probably gonna be it for this video. Like I said, I think I wanna do this in like series or episodes, et cetera, so yeah. This bar stool right here is from my apartment, which this has to go. This is giving very apartment-ish vibes to me. It's time to move on to the big leagues. And so I only have one up here because the other one's downstairs um, in one of the rooms. Uh, but yeah, these are definitely going, so hopefully, I got these bar stools from Overstock, um, but they only came in a set of two. And so I had to buy two sets because I think I wanna do three right here. Um, and so hopefully they're not hard to put together. And hopefully it turns out the way that I envisioned because right now I am really feeling like Janice Zero Decor One. Like, I don't think I'm really liking my decor ideas just yet. So, hopefully, this turns out the way that I envision it to. I hate, I hate these little styrofoam things because if you know, you know. That's all I'm gonna say. like I'm looking at myself it's because I'm actually filming this on my iPhone and so I'm looking at the screen instead of like the camera so I hope this doesn't look weird um but fun fact about me I actually hate reading instructions like I'm such a figure it out on my own type person like seriously um okay so what are we doing oh weird do what do so this this goes on top and then G and E this is E we're gonna take the G and then oh my god
right, guys, so here is how the finished products came out. Here are my bar stools from Overstock. Um, honestly, I haven't sat on them just yet, but I love the look of them, the style. It's exactly what I was looking for. I think it came out perfectly. Um, so on that alone, I would definitely give them a 10 out of 10. The only thing is, so they come in a set of two. So I had to order two sets because I knew I wanted three right here. And one of them came chipped. Um, so I'm definitely gonna reach out to Overstock about that. But I mean, I only wanted three anyway, so it kind of worked out. But that would be the only negative thing I have to say about these bar stools. And so you can also see that I changed out that gray tray that I have right here, had right here. Um, I went and grabbed this one from Target, this marble. I also got this from Target um, and that's it. <laughs> I already had, I got this from Amazon. This is from Amazon. And then honestly, this is a vase that the previous owners left behind. Um, and so I personally think this marble goes a little bit better with the bar stools and the kitchen aesthetics, or there's no aesthetics just yet, but the kitchen cabinets, etc. Let me know what you guys think. Um, which one did you like better? The white marble or that silver one that I had, um, a little earlier? Uh, but yeah, overall, I think this is good. Um, I'm going to switch out my faucet and my half bath or attempt to at least. I think I'm going to do that now. Um, I'm going to switch it to this and I'll show you guys what it is currently. So this is what it looks like currently. It's the one that you just flip up. Um, but I don't like that. I think that looks a little old school. So yeah, that's what we about to do next. All right, so I ended up going with this sink faucet instead. Um, it's a Glacier Bay. Got it from Home Depot. Um, I decided to go with this one instead because the other one, um, my dad was telling me that I would have had to change something about some type of valves in the back. I don't know. Um, I wasn't trying to do that and I wasn't trying to wait for him to do that. So I had already purchased this one to go in the bathroom downstairs. Um, and so I just brought this one up here. I was like, let me see what this one would look like. And honestly, I like this one way better than the, um, the modern, the square, just one handle one that I showed y'all in the earlier video. I like it in this bathroom a lot better. I may end up putting that other one in the bathroom downstairs and maybe up in the master. Um, the faucets in the master are actually good. They're already like this, except for they're like this finish. So yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll do that other modern faucet in that finish upstairs in the master at some point. Not sure, but I really like it. Um, and the reason I chose this finish is because like some of the, the finishes in here are that stainless steel, whatever the heck you call it, um, instead of more like this. And so I think eventually I'm going to change this mirror out because it really bugs me that the finish on this and this is different. Maybe I'm just being OD. I don't know. But that really bugs me for some reason. Um, but yeah, I am not finished with this. I can't figure out like how I want this little configuration to go. I'll probably, or not probably, I will hang, hang some pictures above the toilet. Um, that's probably it. I have this little plant in here. The bathroom's not huge, so like I don't want to overcrowd it, you know? Um, I feel like it doesn't have like a little towel rack on this wall anywhere, so it's kind of like nowhere for people to dry their hands. Um, I feel like eventually I may add that, but that's probably it. I'll probably just make sure I decorate this glass stand nicely so that it kind of adds some flavor to the bathroom. So decorate that, add some photos, maybe add a towel rack. And then of course I'll need like a rug or something in here once I figure out my color schemes, but that'll be it for this bathroom. Um, so yeah, this is the end of the series. It's time for me to go clean up. I don't want to show y'all my living room just yet because it's not done. Um, I have a couch coming in like so a couple of months, so it's not going to be done anytime soon. So I'm going to wait to show y'all what the living room looks like um, when that couch gets here. But yeah, 
and then had this piece right here in my office in my apartment so i just put it right here still need to fill in the spaces of the bookshelf but yeah all right so that's it for today's video thank you guys so much for tuning in and i'll see you in my next one